Ah, okay. <laughs> I'm Franco Taverna. In fourth year, I like to use some more written essays, written assignments, critical thinking, problem solving labs, and stuff like that. So in order to be able to provide those and to grade them, um, we have to kind of get really efficient with it. And Rubik's have provided a way of grading more efficiently, uh, more quickly, so you're, you're able to kind of do more writing uh, within the course. I have three written assignments uh, in the course, and again, the rubric is constructed to give them feedback on the individual sections. I've learned that it makes it much easier and faster to grade, while at the same time providing perhaps more feedback uh, to students. The rubric tool in Quercus also has the option to provide freeform comments in line, uh, so that, that really helps. Rubrics, uh, I think, have improved grading uh, by my TAs for, for different reasons and in different ways. It's more consistent and standardized. The, the TAs are following this, the same criteria, the same uh, instructions, the same uh, standards, each and every student. It also allows students to see the guidelines beforehand and know what's expected of them. I really can't imagine being a TA in this course without having rubrics. I can't imagine the amount of time that I would have had to spend grading without them. They really made my life that much easier. When I first started using rubrics, uh, it, was, it seemed very difficult. I wasn't sure if it was going to work or I uh, wasn't sure how to create them, but very quickly I, I learned to do it well. I would advise my faculty colleagues to explore the use of ru rubrics. Uh, it's not a steep learning curve. I've learned that they're indispensable uh, and they make um, better use of, uh, of our time when we do the evaluations.